Hi guys, this is Umair and today I'm going to start a tutorial series on Adobe Photoshop. Uh, this series will be mainly focusing uh, on editing images. Basically, there are two main things uh, for which Photoshop is used. The first one is designing things like designing logos, designing banners, designing different graphics art for your applications and games. And the second thing for which the Photoshop is being used too much is editing existing images, applying different effects, bringing dead images into life. Uh, there are many photographers in the world, almost every photographer in the world who uh, capture their image and then after capturing they come to Photoshop and they edit uh, that image according to their own requirement. Uh, so this is the series that I'm going to start from today uh, and I just want to make you sure that it, in this series you are going to learn a lot because uh, I'm going to cover many important concepts and amazing techniques uh, that uh, is uh, going to be so interesting and so beneficial for all of you. Uh, and other thing is you are going to uh, learn as much as you can expect to learn from any paid course online because I use Photoshop for both things for designing characters and for editing existing images and I'm going to teach you each and everything that I know about Photoshop uh, so I would recommend you that you install Photoshop in your system and follow along with me because I will be doing small projects after every four or five videos that are required for uh, making that project so uh, the content that I'm going to cover in this series uh, will be uh, basically focusing on uh, this camera filter this that was previously a separate tool other than Photoshop but now it has been added inside Photoshop that is very important to learn that I'm going to explain in detail in my coming videos uh, and these are the tools selection tools that are very important for changing the backgrounds for changing hair colors for applying uh, different effects for merging two images and so many other things I'm going to uh, teach you all those things and uh, different uh, tricks uh, to use these selection tools and there are other uh, tools like um, uh, brush tool uh, and razor tool pen tool which is very important uh, and the text many people I know and I have seen they face they uh, they know these tools but they don't know where to start when they want to start editing their image and they want to add a text over it they don't know uh, what kind of color we should choose for the text and what kind of uh, font size and font style uh, for their image uh, which is based on theory that I'm going to explain in this series basically that is the part of graphic designing but uh, that helps really much in editing images and designing uh, graphics art inside Adobe Photoshop uh, so I'm going to make about 40 to 50 videos in this series uh, so make sure you subscribe this channel and stay tuned and see my each and every video and try to do it by your own as well and the Photoshop that I'm using is Adobe Photoshop CC you can use Adobe Photoshop CS5 CS6 but not uh, the earlier version than the CS5 uh, make sure you all you have already installed Photoshop in your system uh, or laptop whatever uh, you want to use uh, so see you in the next video thank you